everybody. Today I'm going to review Rigid's brand new Gen 5X circular saw, model R8652. Now I got this as part of a larger five-piece toolkit, but today I'm only going to be focusing on the circular saw. And what we're going to be doing is taking a closer look at its different features, and then I'm going to be doing extensive runtime testing, so you'll be able to see the type of performance you're going to get on just one battery charge. Here's a closer look at the full-size circular saw, and it does take the standard seven and a quarter inch blades, and they have included a 24 tooth carbide tip blade with this kit at no extra charge. Now what I want to point out is the fact that the battery is going to slide right on the rear of this unit, and once it does click into place, it's going to be good to go as soon as you pull the trigger. Now the electric brake on this does work exceptionally well. As soon as you release the trigger, the blade pretty much instantly stops and it's not going to continue to spin after you set the saw down. Now the one thing I think people may not like about this particular saw is the fact that the blade guard on the bottom is going to be made out of a heavy duty plastic. It's not a metal blade guard and if you do set this down hard or maybe you drop it, they do stand the risk of that cracking. Now because Rigid does have the lifetime service agreement with their tools, as long as you've registered this, they are going to replace that for you at no extra charge. Now the other thing I want to point out is the fact that the grip on this is very comfortable and narrow, so it's not an oversized grip that most people aren't going to be able to use. No matter what size hand you have, you can grip onto this very comfortably. And when you do grip onto it, they have a separate place to put your other hand on top of the motor housing, so it's going to give you excellent control as you cut with this. To set the bevel of the shoe, they do have a knob right here you can loosen right up. You can move the shoe up to 56 degrees for angled cuts. And then when you are done with it, just put it back into position and tighten that knob back down. To set the depth of the cut, they have a separate lever right here you can lift up. And then you can move the shoe up or down to set the correct depth of whatever you want to cut through. Now the other thing I want to point out is this does have an LED light that's going to cut on and it will light up your cut path as you use it. That can be activated not only by pulling the trigger when the blade's spinning, but they also have that separate switch underneath the grip. And when you push in on that, it's also going to light it up. Now this does not have a time delay LED like the drill or impact driver. As soon as you release it, the light is going to instantly cut off. Now the final thing I want to point out is the fact that the blade change on this is very simple and they do have the hex key that you're going to need to remove the arbor nut included and it installs right in the handle. So you're not going to have to be hunting around for this. It is kept in the handle and it does fit in there nice and tight and it's not going to come out. So that's a real nice thing that it's not going to fall out let's say in the back of your truck. It's locked in place in the handle and when you need it it's going to be there. Now for some runtime testing, we're going to see how many cuts we can get through standard 7 16 OSB on one battery charge.
cuts through standard 716th OSB. So in total, if we're going off board feet, that was 340 feet of 716th OSB it was able to do on just one battery charge. I just popped a fresh blade on here along with a fully charged 4 amp hour battery pack. Now let's see how many cuts we can get through standard 2x4s on just one charge. Two hundred and thirty-four cuts through a standard two by four on just one battery charge. So now you've seen Rigid's brand new Gen 5X full-size seven and a quarter inch circular saw for yourself. This thing is very well balanced. It feels very good in your hand, and I got to tell you, the run times that we got, especially when you consider that this does have a brush motor, were unbelievable. It actually beat the brushless units that I've already tried out, and it does have the maximum amount of run time per battery charge out of any cordless circular saw up until this point. We got 234 cuts through 2x4s, and then 85 cuts through that 7 16 OSB before the battery packs finally died. Now the other thing to point out, this does have Rigid's lifetime service agreement. So as long as you do register it when you buy it, they're going to give you free batteries, free parts, and free service for life. If you like this video, please click like. If you like my channel, please click subscribe. And thanks for watching.